Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm recording on a new camera, so hopefully it sounds good and I'm in focus. It's one of those ones that you kind of got to play with the focus, so hopefully it works good. Um, I hope that you guys are having a wonderful Sunday. Actually, this might not go up on a Sunday. I think this might go up on like a Thursday. So, a wonderful Thursday! Let's do that instead. Um, today I'm going to do another book chit chat. Sorry, I'm sliding off the bed. Um, today we're going to do another book chit chat. I just finished listening. I always listen to books. I don't have time to actually sit down and read. So I listen to books, cleaning, laundry, driving, everything. I listen to books. So this is the book I just finished. It is a trilogy. It's in a trilogy and it is called, the trilogy is Raven, I think is just what they're called. But the first book is called White Raven. I might have to insert an I'm going to insert a picture because I don't know how to make this focus on this. Clearly, just just telling you that. And we're going to have some weird lighting issues, apparently. My, my son's coming and going. Uh, <laughs> anyways, okay. So this book is about a girl, and I believe her name is Piper. I hope so. They don't really say her name very often, so I'm going to cross my fingers that that's what it was. Um, and it, her mother dies unexpectedly in the middle of the night and she has a, she has to look, keep living life and she's responsible now for her brother and her dad kind of shuts himself down and doesn't really like take care of them or anything. So she's like the adult now. Well, her mother's mother, so her grandmother wants them to come spend the summer with her. Now they've never met her before anything, but they do. And when they get there, this lady is wealthy. She was like super rich. And the brother's super excited. The girl, the girl's a little like, she's unimpressed because she didn't really want to do this anyways. So she's kind of unimpressed. She's not really enjoying the situation or making the best of it. She's kind of just pissed off that she has to be there. So she leaves behind her best friend who is a boy and goes to this island and some weird things start happening that she notices. And when I first read the like synopsis of this book and reviews and stuff, I honestly thought it was a vampire story. I'm gonna tell you now, that was the one thing I'll tell you, it is not a vampire story. It is very unique and very different from any book I've read in the way that the story, it's not about vampires, it's about something supernatural that I've never read about. So. It is a really cool topic, it's really different, a little out there, but it's pretty cool. And so I really enjoyed it just for that purpose, like it wasn't another vampire story because I was certain it was, but nope, it's not. Okay, um, over that, but it is a kind of a supernatural, but it's, it's really good. And of course, because any good story has love in it, it's got a love story. But again, the love story has some twists to it, and I'm really curious to see how the author plays with them in the next two books. Because in this book, a lot kind of happened with their love story, and it's complicated, of course, because all love stories and books have to be complicated. Um, so yeah, it's it was the, the book itself was very unpredictable. Most of the time, I read a book and I'm like, okay, you can kind of tell what's gonna happen, but this story was very unpredictable. I honestly really enjoyed it and really loved this book, and I'm super excited to dive right into the next one. I'm hoping it's just as good. I think it's going to be, well, I'll talk about that next time, but I'm super excited to read the second one. Um, yeah, this is going to be really fast and sweet and to the point, but usually book reviews are because you can't give away too much detail. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you go and either read this book, listen to this book, somehow get this book into your head because it is a good one and I really think you'll like it. And we'll see you with the next book chit chat. Thanks for watching. Bye, you guys.